Hi, Hi guys. guys! Welcome back to my channel. I'm Lauren, and as always, I'm Philip. That's Philip. And in today's video, we are doing the last part to our Little Debbie ice cream review. We found, or I found, the last flavor, which is honey buns. Honey buns, and so. This is our last review. Now in this review, because we only have one ice cream and otherwise it would be super short, since Philip has never tried a honey bun before, mm -hmm. um, I walked up to our local gas station because I didn't feel like going to the store and I got us a honey bun each. I just got one big little Debbie honey bun and cut it in half yeah. for him to try and then we'll compare it to the actual ice cream and just rate it in general. Before we start the video, first I want to say thank you to everyone because I have hit 50 subscribers and I am so happy and I really appreciate it. Is it kind of embarrassing that it took this long? Eh. But I'm really happy because it's kind of like a milestone. Um, I want to say thank you to the special subscriber that got me to 50 and that was Britt and Tay and I'll throw a picture of the subscriber because I got the little um, alert I think yesterday or the day before but yep it was Britt and Tay so thank you so much for being my 50th subscriber I really appreciate it and she also left a really nice comment under my omelet video so I'm definitely going to implement it if I ever make another omelet video and hopefully I find a really good recipe but with all that being said, thank you, thank you, thank you, and let's get into the video. And first we're gonna start off with, like I said, trying these honey buns. All right, so, like I said before, we're gonna try our honey buns. Um, Philip, do you wanna try yours first? Mm-hmm. I found these really big little Debbie honey buns at our local gas station, cause I didn't feel like going to the store, so I just walked up there. It was like a 10 minute walk there and back. Are you cutting yours? Yeah. Dude, if you don't just pick it up. Mm-hmm. And I got it because Philip has never had a honey bun before, so I figured this will be really good and make the video a little longer. Mm -hmm. What do you think, Philip? It tastes kind of like a cheap honey, a cheap um, cinnamon. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And there's cinnamon in it and stuff, but it's pretty good. Yeah. You okay. think this was enough of a taste? Uh, yeah, I'll have the rest of mine in a sec. Mm -hmm. Just gonna... I should have brought some water. Uh... Let's say I'm not that thirsty, but you can get some if you want. No, I'm good. All right, so now that he's tried the honey bun, we have the honey bun favored ice cream. And as always, I love this really pretty silver packaging they have at the top. We're gonna go ahead and open it. Put this up. Ooh, that looks nice. Yeah. Mmm, okay. Hope it tastes how it looks. Oh. Okay, it's scooping really creamy. There's a swirl of cinnamon, Ooh. I think. I think that's cinnamon. Yeah, it looks like it. It looks like cinnamon. Tastes like cinnamon? I don't know if there's cinnamon in here. There might be. You try yours. Yeah. All right, first scoop. All right, mm -hmm. first scoop. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's cinnamon. Mm -hmm. That's cinnamon. No, this isn't too bad. It has a very creamy taste to it. I wouldn't say it's the same creamy as the oatmeal raisin. Because mm -hmm. it definitely doesn't have like a vanilla aftertaste. Like like we said, it has that cinnamon in there. But it's cream, like it has the creamy texture. Yeah. And it also tastes more creamy to me. You know, it's less vanilla. Hmm. I think this is pretty good. I don't think there's any cake pieces in this, but the deeper you go, or maybe this is just our tub, but the deeper you go, the browner the cinnamon swirls get. Oh, wait a minute, I think I did find a cake piece. Yeah, I think I tasted a cake piece in mine too. Uh-oh. Mm-hmm. Oh. It's crunchy. Yeah. Oh. It's ginger snappy. The cake piece in this one is it's like ginger snaps. Mm-hmm. Not mushy at all. Yeah. But I don't like the aftertaste it leaves. It's like a cracker. 
It's kind of like cinnamon toast crunch to me. Yeah, there it is. It's like a cinnamon toast crunch. Oh, here you go. Sorry, Phil. It's all right. Here you go. Oh, I think there's one right there. Thank you. Mm hmm. He's absolutely right. It's like cinnamon toast, soggy cinnamon toast crunch. Like a generic brand cinnamon toast crunch, if I should say. Mm. Mm. Got another one. Did you get one? Yeah. Mm hmm. Mm. Yeah. But you know what? I think this is one of those flavors that old people will like. I guess I'm old people one. Yep. Oh yeah, wait. And there's like a thick. Let me see. <laughs> Look, is this all cinnamon? Because yeah. I know this ain't chocolate. Because honey buns don't have chocolate in it. Let me see if you guys can see this. Yeah, it's cinnamon, I think. Wait. Sorry. Look, that big brown splotch, I think that's like all cinnamon. Yeah, it's cinnamon. And There's no chocolate inside in this one. Yeah. I don't really know if I like this one, you guys. I think this is like an in-between of what I've been saying in the last two videos. I'm not sure if I would get it if it was the last one or eat it at like a kid's birthday party because it's just kind of like a meh flavor for me. It's just... There's nothing that's outright outstanding for it that would be like, oh, I like that part of that flavor. Like how the um, like how the oatmeal raisin, even though I didn't like the oatmeal pieces, I was like, you know what, I like the flavor of the ice cream itself and I would still get it. Or like how the Swiss was just outright outstanding and I liked everything about it. But this, it just tastes like what you would find in like an old ice cream parlor, like like an old, old flavor. Maybe this is what this is. I don't know. It kind of tastes like French toast, maybe. Yeah, I can see that. I don't think it tastes like a honey bun, but it does kind of taste like French toast like, and like mixed with cereal, with like like what he said, the cinnamon mm -hmm. toast crunch. Yeah, and I gotta say I agree with that. Mm-hmm. And I, I don't know. I don't know about this flavor, you guys. I would give this flavor because it's an okay flavor. It's it's just okay for me. I would give it mm, a five. Personally, I'd say I'd give it a seven. I think that, like, it's a very strange flavor, but it's a good kind of strange to me. Mm hmm Yeah. Whereas the strawberry shortcake just tasted like fake artificial flavoring. This definitely isn't too artificial, but... It's not. It's not my cup of tea. I think for this one, you have to like it very. Like you, this is a very specific flavor for a very specific person. But it's not bad. But it's not good either. Yeah. But still, okay. I don't know if that contradicts anything I just said and rambled about. But still, it's. It, it's okay. Yeah. And I'm eating this still because again, it was four dollars at my Walmart, and it was the last one too. Mm -hmm. What about you, Phil? I said my opinion, but what's your opinion on it? Well, like I said mine earlier, but um, it's a very strange flavor. It's very striking for an ice cream, but I'd say that that kind of makes it stand out. It's it's not like the best ice cream I've ever tasted, but for what it's worth, it's pretty good in my opinion. Mm -hmm. Alright, well, is this the end of the video? Yeah, I say so. All right, this was a quick video today. Um, that's our ending remarks. I gave it a five, you gave it a seven. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, um, this is the end of our Little Debbie ice cream series. Um, if we find any other interesting ice creams at our local Walmart or just stores in general, we'll definitely give them a try. But other than that, before we end the video, I do want to say again, thank you, thank you, thank you for 50 subscribers. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much, Britton Tay, for being my 50th subscriber. And thank you for tuning in to our video today. I appreciate it. And I know Philip appreciates it. Mm -hmm. um, before we end the video, 
please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. I really appreciate it. And now I want to get to 100 subscribers. So I'm definitely going to keep doling out these videos. And hopefully you guys enjoy them. Um, but other than that, remember to like, comment, and subscribe down below. Again, I really appreciate it. And you guys have a great rest of your day. Bye, guys. Bye.